And we're just starting with the physical body sitting in such a way that our back feels very like it's supporting the rest of the body. That the spine is like a stack of coins, one on top of the other, as stably aligned as it can be. Strong, stable back. And then moving your focus forward into your core, the internal organs and surface muscles of the stomach. Just allow all of that to soften, nothing clenched or held in nothing tight or clenched. Strong back, soft front. And bring your focus up to the crown of your head and gradually scan down all the way down to the tips of your toes, allowing any tension remaining to release. And having settled the body, then bring your focus to the mind and gently nudge the mind back into altruism, bodhicitta, that we do this practice in order to deepen our bodhicitta, developing the mind to its utmost potential for the benefit of all sentient beings. And all sentient beings includes ourselves, not leaving out any sentient being. and visualize on the crown of my head, seated upon a white lotus and moon disc is the protector, my root guru, Chenrezig. He is white in color and has one face and four arms. The first two hands are joined together at his heart, holding a wish-fulfilling gem. His second right hand holds a crystal rosary, while his second left hand holds a white lotus. He is seated in the cross-legged Vajra posture, clothed in fine silk garments, and is adorned with precious ornaments. And 
And just take a moment and stabilize that visualization above your crown. And whether you're able to stabilize clearly or not, feel very certain that Chenrezig, one in nature with all of your teachers, is present. Think that he's made of transparent light and is able to move three-dimensional, real. The syllables om, ah, and whom at his three places emit light that invites Guru Chenrezig from his natural abode. Guru Chenrezig dissolves into the Guru Chenrezig on my crown, who becomes the essence of the three refuges. And so that Chenrezig at your crown invites the actual Chenrezig Buddha from his natural abode. And they merge and become one. Chenrezig that you've imagined and the Chenrezig that exists become inseparable. And with that awareness, we do the refuge in Bodhicitta prayer. Sangye chudum sogi chunam la Janchu padu dani gapsu chi Dagi jin sogi ve sonam ki Rola penche sangye drupa show Sangye chudum sogi chunam la Janchu padu dani gapsu chi Dagi jin sogi ve sonam ki and you can repeat that in your mind in English, reinforcing it, letting it sink in. And we think, especially for the benefit of all sentient beings, I will quickly, very quickly, attain the precious state of perfect and complete Buddhahood. For this reason, I will practice the yoga method of Chenrezig Buddha with one face and four arms. Especially for the benefit of all sentient beings, I will quickly, very quickly, attain the precious state of perfect and complete Buddhahood. For this reason, I will practice the yoga method of Chenrezig Compassion Buddha 
with one face and four arms, especially for the benefit of all sentient beings, I will quickly, very quickly, attain the precious state of perfect and complete Buddhahood. For this reason, I will practice the yoga method of Chenrezig Compassion Buddha with one face and four arms. May all sentient beings have happiness and the causes of happiness. May they be free of suffering and the causes of suffering. May they not be separated from happiness that is free of suffering. May they abide with equanimity, free from attachment to attractive objects and hatred for repulsive objects. May all sentient beings possess happiness and the causes of happiness. May they be free of suffering and the causes of suffering. May they not be separated from happiness that is free of suffering. May they abide with equanimity, free from attachment to attractive objects and hatred for repulsive objects. May all sentient beings possess happiness and the causes of happiness. May they be free of suffering and the causes of suffering. May they not be separated from happiness that is free of suffering. May they abide with equanimity, free from attachment to attractive objects and hatred for repulsive objects. Letting your mind connect with love, compassion, joy, and equanimity. and purifying the place. Everywhere may the ground be pure, free of the roughness of pebbles and so forth. May it be in the nature of lapis lazuli and as smooth as the palm of one's hand. May human and divine offerings, actual, arranged and mentally created, clouds of finest Samatabhadra offerings fill the entire space. And so you think of all of the offerings set out here in the gompa, in your own room, any temples you may have seen. And then you imagine that they multiply and fill all of space. Beautiful water, flowers, incense, perfume, food, music, And try and hold that visualization while we add the offering cloud mantra. Um Namo Bhagavate Vajrasama Pramadana Tatagataya Hahate Samyak Sam Buddhaya Tayata Hom Vajri Vajri Maha Vajri Maha Tira Vajra Maha Vida Vajra Bodhi Tira Vajra Maha Bodhi Mendo Pesam Kramana Vajra Sawakama Avarana Vishadana Vajri Soha Om Namo Bhagavate Vajrasava Pramadana Tadagataya Ahate Samyak Sambudaya Tayata Om Vajra Vajra Maha Vajra Maha Tira Vajra Maha Vijavad Ahabodhi Tira Vajra Maha Bodhi Mendo Pasam Kamana Vajrasava Avarana Vishadana Vajra Soha Om Namo Bhagavate Vajrasava Pramadana Tadagataya Ahate Samyak Sambudaya Tayata Om Vajra Vajra Maha Vajra Maha Tira Vajra Avida Vajra Maha Bodhi Tira Vajra Maha Bodhi Mendo Pasam Kamana Vajrasava Avarana Vishadana Vajra Soha By the power of the truth of the three jewels, 
of the blessings of all the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas, by the power of the great might of the completed two accumulations and of the completely pure inconceivable sphere of reality, may all these offerings become just so. To Chenrezig Compassion Buddha, I prostrate with my body, speech, and mind. I present clouds of every type of offering, actual and imagined. I declare all my negative actions accumulated since beginningless time and rejoice in the merit of all holy and ordinary beings. Please remain until the end of cyclic existence and turn the wheel of Dharma for living beings. I dedicate my own merits and those of all others to the great enlightenment. <laughs> Chenrezig, whose body is pure white, unstained by defilements, whose head is adorned by the fully enlightened Buddha Amitabha. To you who gaze upon all sentient beings with eyes of boundless compassion, I make offerings. Iyadam Guru Ratna Mandala Kamniya Tayami. And now we bless the offerings. If you have the empowerment, Otherwise, imagine the front or crown generated Chenrezig performing these actions. Instantly arise the holy body of great compassionate one. Om Padmatadri Hum Pe Om Sawashuda Sawadama Sawashudo Hum. The offering substances become just empty. From within emptiness, from broom, vast and extensive precious vessels arise. From within each, the syllable Om melts into light, from which arise drinking water, water for bathing the feet, flowers, incense, lamps, perfume, food, and music. Empty in nature, they have the aspect of the individual types of offerings and function to bestow special uncontaminated bliss. Um Bhagyamai Hum Om Padyamai Hum Om Pupeya Hum 
Om Dupayahu, Om Halakayahu, Om Gandayahu, Om Nudayahu, Om Shaptahu, Om Rupaahu, Om Shaptahu, Om Gandayahu, Om Razaahu, Om Sprazaahu. Whatever slight virtue I have created by paying homage, offering and acknowledging my faults, rejoicing and requesting that the Buddhas stay and teach, I now dedicate all this for full awakening. And the self-generation, if you have the empowerment, you do as written. If you don't have the empowerment, you imagine these things happening in the space in front. Kum sawa shuda sawadama sawa shuda hum. The natures of myself, the deity to be meditated upon, and all phenomena are in essence one taste in emptiness. From the sphere of emptiness, the aspect of the tone of the mantra, Om Mani Padme Hum resounds, pervading the realm of space. My mind, in the aspect of the undifferentiable suchness of myself and the deity becomes a moon mandala, upon which the very aspect of the tone of the mantra resounding in space is set down. Having the form of written syllables, the sounds and the written letters mixing, like very per mercury adhering to grains of gold. that completely transforms into a thousand petal lotus, as brilliant as refined gold, marked at the center by the mantra, Om Mani Padme Hum. From the tips of multicolored light rays emitted from the moon, lotus, and mantra, innumerable holy bodies of the Arya Avalokiteshvara spread out, pervading all the realms of space. Great clouds of miraculously emanated offerings are beautifully offered to the Buddhas and their children. From yet another great emanated cloud, a continuous rain of nectar descends, extinguishing the fires of suffering of all migrators of the hells and other realms. They are satisfied with bliss and become Avalokiteshvara. Then the light rays, along with the bodies of the deity, return and enter into one's own mind in the aspect of the moon mandala, lotus, and mantra garland. These transform into a multicolor lotus and moon seat upon which oneself arises is Arya Avalokiteshvara with one face and four arms, or in the space in front. The first two hands are joined together at the heart and hold a wish-fulfilling gem. The second right hand holds a crystal rosary, while the second left hand holds the stem of a white lotus.
Arya Avakiteshvara is seated cross-legged in the Vajra posture, clothed in fine silk garments and is adorned with precious ornaments. He has a white colored holy body, is in the prime of youth and radiates rays of light. Stabilize clear appearance. At the crown is a white om, at the throat a red ah, at the heart a blue hum. Upon a moon mandala at the heart is a white hri. And then we touch and bless the five places with the lotus mudra. Om Bema Boy so ah. 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 Light rays radiate from the free at the heart. Invoking from their natural abodes, Arya Avalokiteshvara, surrounded by the entire assembly of Buddhas and Bodhisattvas. Om Haya Lokeshvari Sapari Vare Vajra Samaya Zaza Zaza They become non dual with oneself, the commitment being, or the being in front. Again, light rays radiate from the free at the heart, invoking the empowering deities, the five Buddha families, with Amitabha as their principle, together with their retinues. Om Bhadra Samaja. All Tathagatas, please confer the empowerment upon me. Om Sawa Tathagata Abhishekata Samaya Shriyaya they bestow the empowerment with vase water, thereby the entire body is filled and all stains are purified. From a transformation of the excess water remaining on the crown, the crown becomes adorned with Amitabha. And blessing the offerings, if you have the empowerment, Otherwise, these are these actions are performed by the deity in front. Om Padma Tatri Hum Pei. Om Sawa Shuddha Sawa Dama Sawa Shuddha Hum. Tompani Duegu. The offerings become just empty. From within emptiness, from room syllables. Vast and extensive precious vessels arise. Within each, the syllable Om melts into light, from which arise drinking water, water for bathing the feet, flowers, incense, lamps, perfume, food, and music. Empty in nature, they have the aspect of the individual types of offerings and function to bestow special uncontaminated bliss. Um Agyam Padyam Huape Duape Haloke Gande Nuade Chapta Ayum. And then we visualize the offerings are actually being presented. Um, I 
Ayalokeshware Sapari Ware Ayam Prati Sarsoha Om Ayalokeshware Sapari Ware Ayam Prati Sarsoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari War Yuape Prati Sasoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari War Dupe Prati Sasoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari War Aloke Prati Sarsoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari War Gande Prati Sarsoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari War Nude Prati Sarsoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari War Shabta Prati Sarsoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari Var Rupa Prati Sasoha Om Maya Lokeshwara Sapari Var Shabta Prati Sasoha Om Maya Lokeshwara Sapari Var Gande Prati Sasoha Om Maya Lokeshwara Sapari Var Raza Prati Sasoha Om Maya Lokeshwari Sapari Wari Sraza Prati Sasoha Whatever slight virtue I have created by paying homage, offering and acknowledging my faults, rejoicing and requesting that the Buddhas stay and teach, I now dedicate all this for full awakening. To Arya Chenrezig, whose body is pure white, unstained by defilements, whose head is adorned by the fully enlightened Buddha Amitabha. To you who gaze upon all sentient beings with eyes of boundless compassion, I prostrate. And then we bless the mala, the rosary beads, if you have one. You hold the rosary in your cupped hands while saying the mantra. Om Guru Sawa Tata Gata Kaya Vakchita Vaja Pramanana Sawa Tata Gata Vaja Pada Pada Nam Karomi Om Vazumate Shri Soha 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 Om Vazumate Shri Soha, Om Vazumate Shri Soha, Om Vazumate Shri Soha. And now the visualization for the mantra recitation time. On a moon disc at one's heart, or at the heart of Chenrezig in front, is the concentration being the syllable Hri, surrounded by garlands of the mantra to be recited, white in color and standing clockwise. Light rays radiate from them, filling all the inside of one's body and purifying all negativities and obscurations. Light rays radiate outward from which an incalculable assembly of deities of the great compassion Buddha 
with one face and four arms are emanated. Again, light rays are emitted, purifying the negativities and obscurations of all sentient beings and setting them in the state of Arya Avokiteshvara. These then collect back and dissolve into the free at one's heart. So this is the visualization to gently and slowly repeat as we do the mantra. So we'll recite the long Durrani one time and then the short mantra many times. Verochana buharatsaya, tata gataya, ahate samyak sambudaya, namo sawa tata gate be, ahate be samyak sambuda be, namo sawa avalokite, shoraya bodhisattvaya, Mahapsatmaya, Mahakarunikaya, Tayata, Om Dara Dara, Diri Diri, Duru Duru, Ite Vate Sole Sole, Prasale Prasale, Kusume Kusume, Wari hili mili siti tsol apanaya soha. Om mani pen mei hum. 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 Om Mani Padme 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 Hum. And just continue the mantra now under your breath so that only you can hear it. Air is still passing through. Oh, money, pay me, oh, money, pay me, oh, money.
to just continue the mantra under your breath. You can keep the visualization simple, just gentle radiating white light going out, coming in like a breath or as written in the sadhana. Omani Padme Hum. And then we recite the hundred syllable mantra to purify any mistakes or omissions. Om Pema Sava Samaya Manu Palaya Pema Sava Dena Varisha Dito Mebawa Sudo Kaya Mebawa Supo Kaya Mebawa Anarakta Mebawa Sava Siddhi Me Prayatsa Sava Kama Sutsa Siddham Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bangawa Sava Tata Gata Vanuva Me Mutsa Padma Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahum Pe Om Pema Sapa Samaya Manu Palaya Pema Sapa Deno Bari Shadi Romeba Sudo Kaya Mebawa Subo Kaya Mebawa Hanarakta Meba Sawa Sudi Me Prayatsa Sawa Kama Sutsam Sidam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Padma Mame Padma Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahum Pe Om Padma Sapa Samaya Manu Palaya Padma Sapa Dena Parisha Rira Meba Sudo Kaya Mebawa Subo Kaya Meba Anarakta Mebawa Sawa Siddhi Me Prayatsa Sawa Kama Sutsan Siddham Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Baga Sawa Tata Gata Padma Mame Padma Bawa Maha Samaya Sapa Ahum Pe and think that any mistakes have been completely purified. Arya Avlokiteshvara, with one face, four arms, please cleanse and purify all diseases, spirit harm, negativities and obscuration of all sentient beings like myself. Please enhance and increase the life, merit and all qualities of scriptural dharma and realization dharma. Arya Avlokiteshvara, with one face, four arms. Please cleanse and purify all diseases, spirit harm, negativities and obscurations of all sentient beings like myself. Please enhance and increase the life, merit, and all qualities of scriptural dharma and realization dharma. Arya Avlokiteshvara, with one face and four arms. Please cleanse and purify all diseases, spirit harm, negativities and obscuration of all sentient beings like myself. Please enhance and increase the life, merit, and all qualities of scriptural dharma and realization dharma. And we dedicate. <laughs> Jo <laughs> 
special by the force of the praises and requests made to you may all diseases evil spirits poverty and quarrels be calmed and may the dharma and good fortune increase in the regions in which i and others dwell to arya chenrezi whose body is pure white unstained by defilements whose head is adorned by the fully enlightened Buddha Amitabha, to you who gaze upon all sentient beings with eyes of boundless compassion, I prostrate. May the supreme jewel bodhicitta that has not arisen arise and grow, and may that which has arisen not diminish, but increase more and more. Just as the brave Manjushri and Samatabhatra too realize things as they are, I too dedicate all these merits in the best way that I may follow their perfect example. I dedicate all these roots of virtue with a dedication praised as the best by the victorious ones thus gone of the three times so I might perform good works. Whatever slight virtue I have accumulated by prostrating, offering and confessing, rejoicing, urging, and requesting the Buddha's stay and teach, and now dedicate all this for full awakening. Due to this merit in all my lives, may I never be parted from perfect gurus. May I enjoy the abundance of the Dharma, perfecting all qualities of the stages and paths. May I quickly attain the state of Vajadhara. Tan <laughs> Gariya rawe goe jing kam dir, pendong de wa malu jang wei, jen re zi wan ten zing gat soi, sha pe si te badu ten gyu chi. Savior of the Snowland teachings and transmigratory beings, who extensively clarifies the path that unifies emptiness and compassion. To the lotus in hand, Lord Tenzin Gatso, I beseech, may all your holy wishes be fulfilled. Me may say, wait a gen gen rezing, dream a campe wam You can relax your attention. So that's the practice just on its own. And uh, the next session, I'll explain a few of the components and then we'll do it again, hopefully more deeply. And as the day progresses, um, we'll understand more and more. So if there's anything that immediately came to mind that you wanted to unpack, make sure you make a little note of it now and, um, and then we can talk about it in the next session. So um, see you in an hour.
Thanks.